top. And for more now, we bring in our Aditi Kinkabwala live for us there with the Browns in Berea, Ohio. Uh, Aditi Kinkabwala, what is up next for these busy Browns? Well, Rhett, Ian told us this morning that Carlos Hyde is going to has come to terms with the Browns and will officially sign later on today. This is a really good pickup. Carlos Hyde is a big back who runs like a big back. He's physical. He's got really good vision, and he still has enough quickness to pretty much fit any scheme. He played 16 games last year. Now, he's definitely a nice compliment to Duke Johnson, who's already here. But this is where this gets interesting, Red. In this town, there's been a lot of conversation about running back Saquon Barkley in the draft. I've been told that take it, that signing Carlos Hyde does not disqualify Barkley. That does not mean that Barkley comes off the board here. Remember that Hugh Jackson has worked with multiple backs. He likes the platoon of backs. And look, we saw these two Super Bowl teams both use three backs apiece. That was my next question to you, so I'm glad you settled that, wondering what that might, uh, the Hyde signing might do uh, to Saquon Barkley and the potential that they draft him uh, at one or four or maybe somewhere else. Uh, but how about this uh, free agency strategy here under uh, first-year GM John Dorsey? Well, there's still a lot of needs here, Rhett. And look, this is a team that is trying to get more veteran. It's trying to get a little older. We talked about this quite a bit yesterday, Rhett. 36 of the 53 players on this team's final roster were either in their first or second year. This is a team that needs players who not only know how to gut out wins at the end of a game, but actually play games. So that's what we've seen in these first few days of this free agency frenzy. That's acquiring veteran guys. Now, here are two positions that I've got my eye on right now. This team needs need some veteran depth at cornerback in their secondary. They did sign Demarius Randall, but they're moving him to safety. So watch for a move at cornerback today. And there also needs to be some help at wide receiver, a veteran wide receiver. You need playmakers in both of those spots. So, Rhett, hopefully you'll be coming back to me pretty soon. <laughs> All right, sounds good. Aditi Kinkabwala expecting to be busy there.